if you will be as lucky as I am, you will be as lucky as I am. Anytime you see a person who is doing anything exceptional, it is not luck. And let me just even be bold to say it's not favor. Wisdom series for success. It's not favor. It's not grace. God is not selective with grace. God's grace is abundant to all. But there is something called frustrating the grace of God. So, being grazed by God is God's investment in you. Being disciplined is your investment in yourself. You went um, some leadership little forum recently, and I said some of you would think, "Look, he's just lucky." You know, this man is just lucky. And I said to him, I said to them, I said. If you will be as lucky as I am, you will be as lucky as I am. Uh, so don't, the luck is good. But for 10 years, I've been out of Canaan land three Sundays. For how many years? That's how lucky I've been. I'll tell you how many times I've gone on leave. Now for 20 years in Lagos, I've been out of church on Sunday morning. Ten times. Wherever I am in the world, I'm flying. Even, even if it's 4 a.m. in the morning on Saturday, on Sunday morning. Just to show how lucky I can be. When Paul is saying I can do all things through Christ, he's not talking about grace. He says he's talking about discipline. He says in a race, the reason why people win is because they are temperate in all things. Never look at somebody who is exceptional in any field and just say, God has blessed him. That is the lazy man's observation. Whom has God not blessed? Whom? I mean, tell me somebody that God hasn't blessed. Is there any in this hall who, who says God hasn't blessed me? No. The beggar on the roadside, you think God hasn't blessed him? He has life. He can breathe. He has a brain. He has hands. He has legs. What do you call that? Blessing. Where is he? Begging. Now for 28 years, I have kept a work schedule that is not less than 16 hours a day. I'm really very lucky. Today we have over 6,000 people in our employment that earn their monthly wages from the system. I'm really very lucky. Paul says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I can do anything that God wants me to do. So, if I know God has called me to be a musician, I have to train my voice. I cannot just sit and hope that the anointing will come upon me and all of a sudden I'll sit, sing at those high notes we're hearing here. This kind does not come by grace. This kind comes by 10 hours of training daily. You know, one of these great writers said, success is a matter of luck. Ask any failure. That's his conclusion. It's luck. But ask any first class student in school and they will let you know his first class investment in his studies that resulted into his first class rating in class. Wisdom series for success.